Aloha from Hawaii Volcanoes National Park. I'm Ranger Dave, and today we're going to talk about one of our park's most amazing creations of nature, lava tubes. Now the formation of lava tubes all starts with the flow of basaltic lava here at the surface. And just like water, lava tends to flow into the low areas of the landscape as it makes its way down slope. The flowing lava is about 2,000 degrees Fahrenheit, which is incredibly hot. But when it's here at the surface, exposed to the open air, it actually cools and hardens from the outside in fairly quickly. The lava flow will start to create a channel, just like a river. And just like a river in the wintertime, the channel will start to crust or freeze over from the outer edges towards the middle. And once the channel is completely crusted over, temperature loss is minimal over miles of travel. At this early stage in the formation, the tube is relatively wide, shallow, and the crust is thin. An increase of lava coming through the tube could cause surface breakouts from the ceiling flowing over the tube system and thickening the crust. Now, over time, the lava flowing through the tube will actually thermally erode the floor and downcut just like a 2,000 degree river. With increased downcutting, the tube will actually enlarge and the flow of lava will only be possibly midway and right above it will be a section of superheated gas and air. The intense heat of the lava inside the tube will actually remelt the walls and the ceiling, creating soda straw stalactites and other unique formations only found in lava tubes. These delicate structures are only formed in a tube that has an active flow. Now after the eruption stops, the tube system will actually drain out fairly quickly, leaving us with a truly amazing creation of nature that will soon develop its, an ecosystem of its own. Here in Hawaii Volcanoes National Park, we encourage our visitors to explore Nahuku Lava Tube with a guide or on your own. Just remember that the geologic features inside a tube only form when there's an active flow. So please be careful. Now knowledge is the key to preservation and by knowing how to properly visit lava tubes, you can help us preserve these truly amazing creations of nature. Aloha.